Good morning. Saval Ker. How are you? Ker. My name is Josephine. Isn't I have Josephine Faber? Thank you. Sukuran. My name is Lena Joan. I am 10 years old. <laughs> My name is Peter Taban Alfred. I'm 18 years old. Korea, Father, if you agree to go to take a course or to. Uh, 200,000 kids in South Sudan are going without education. But some other children have nothing. They don't have uh, money, their parents are not working. And people are just shooting anyhow, people are dying anyhow. You just see a gun sword anyhow, you don't study well, even sometimes school is off on. Many of their games are the same as the ones shared by millions of young people around the world. I believe as a Christian that we are made in God's image and yet we're all different, all our cultures are different. Over 7 million people have been affected by this compounding emergency. It's very difficult to find anybody throughout the country that hasn't been affected in some way by this, uh, this disaster. And there is a hope and a continued aspiration for this country that peace will be restored in this nation. Uh, and that's my continued prayer for this country. Caritas South Sudan as the developmental wing of the church, and Caritas in this case the church also, cares for the poor of the poorest. Around 7 million uh, people in South Sudan are in need of assistance. So I'm calling for the people on the other part of the world to do fundraising for us in South Sudan. Fighting is uh, better bad enough. So people are killing and they are now suffering as you saw us. We are suffering in the camp now. Just outside a camp on the outskirts of Juba, a woman called Nandor helps supervise a market store to provide for her family. They are sick and need medication. She is praying for only good to come to her family. really suffered. We have suffered, we have lost lives, lives, thousands of lives. In South Sudan, when there is peace, there is life. Without peace, there is no life. Our action plan for peace has three pillars. One is advocacy. The second, dialogue. The third is reconciliation, which, will, which includes trauma healing. Peace is when there is no gunshots. Uh, peace is when we are all happy and we accept the diversity of this country because we have very many 
language is spoken in this country. So that is peace according to me. For many South Sudanese living in camps, it can be a struggle to provide food for every family member. More than half of the people living in camps are children. Goodbye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.